Hey everybody, it is Christina Marie here with a holiday video. I am very excited to be um, doing this. This will be my first time doing a holiday series. And um, what I really wanted to talk about was something that I'm really excited about. I am actually throwing a Christmas party within the next two weeks for um, my girls that I mentor. and. I've been thinking of makeup looks and outfits and just planning the party all you know all together and there's just so much to do but then I said I think I want to do a holiday lipstick video I just think that's really fun like all the different colors that you can wear I was originally just gonna do a holiday reds vi video just showing all the different red colors um, that you can wear on your lips but or different shades of red and I just decided to go ahead and do a video of just all the different colors that I personally would wear for the holidays and I would just share them with you guys and do some recommendations you can see I went to Jack in the Box before I started filming this video what I want to go ahead and do is uh, talk about all the different types of holiday lipsticks I will and can wear and suggest that you know suggest to you as well um, some of them may be limited edition, while others are most definitely permanent. So I wanted to give you a wide variety. So let's go ahead and get started. I'll start with the color I have on my lips right now. And this is actually a drugstore lipstick. This is um, Rimmel London's lipstick. I guess it's the Kate one right here. This is the packaging. And it's in number 11. And here is the shade. It's a deep, deep red like a brick red almost and it's very pretty has a nice satin finish as you can see here on my lips it's not too sheeny and it's not matte it's actually perfect it feels really good on the lips and it has a pretty decent smell to it as well it doesn't stink it doesn't smell chemically or anything like that um this is a drugstore lipstick like i mentioned so it's very affordable i want to say it was like five bucks or something like that but yeah this is a really really good shade an affordable shade this one's a little lighter this is actually um a mac lipstick in lady danger and this is more of an orangey red but this is for more of the daring people lady danger you know so yeah people who um are a little more daring i am typically around holiday season and here's this color it is like it's an orange red it's very very pretty it comes off orange on my skin almost but I think that would be absolutely gorgeous for a Christmas party especially if you're wanting to be like a little more um just you know to stand out a little bit more another MAC one in Ruby Woo it's your classic red lipstick and it's a matte and there it is right there just your classic red and then right behind that these two shades are extremely extremely similar um it is Russian red by Mac as well very similar to Ruby Woo like almost identical Russian red is a bit more vibrant than Ruby Woo but they're very very close See, that's Russian red right yeah that's Russian red right there so you can see on my hand they're very different but like in the tube when they're right next to each other they look almost identical so you can see right there that's Ruby Woo that is Russian red and I love Russian red but Woo, Ruby Woo would be my go-to lipstick all the time for red the next shade is another MAC lipstick called So Shod very similar to um lady danger a teeny bit tamer just a little bit tamer this one comes off as more of an orange but i really like it there it is there's lady danger and there is so shod very pretty like i said these are more out there in your face kind of colors I have um, Tarte's Fiery Little um, Lip Surgeon's Natural Matte Lip Tint. This is just another alternative. 
it's very similar to the Ruby Woo. Matter of fact, I wear them together all the time. There's Ruby, there's um, the Tarte Lip Surgeons lip tint right there, right next to Ruby Woo. So when I really want to deepen my red lip, I'll put this on first and then I'll put my red lipstick on top of it. This is a Sephora lipstick in, I have no idea. Oh, Sephora Rouge in RO3. I guess that's a weird name basic red like a, it's a blue red and I'll swatch that one right there I love this this is just your a basic gorgeous red I, this is turning into a holiday reds video well it's not really I'm just doing the reds first Here, oh another red Mac this is a limited edition if you don't have it then you probably can't wear it, but something very similar to it. It's a matte uh, MAC shade in Red Racer. It's a satin finish. And this is what it looks like. You can do without, but if you have it, that's the only reason I'm putting it in this video, is if you already have it, then by all means use it. There it is. And then there's the swatch right there. Very, very pretty. So another option for you then I think that is all with my reds let's move on to my pinks and plums actually one more red thing I actually I got this for free with my CVS reward bucks this is a L'Oreal infallible lip gloss in number 320 320 red fatale and I don't really like this because I don't like the consistency, but if you have it, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous color. Absolutely gorgeous. So, there it is right there, if you have it. Like I said, I personally, personally don't like it, but because the holiday season is here, this will be a good time for me to use it and get all my use out of it and just toss it at the end of the Christmas season. Let's go ahead and move on to my pinks. You can wear pinks for the holidays, guys. It doesn't have to be red. I, you know, I fully respect the pinks. Pinks look amazing on a lot of people, so let's go ahead and keep it real. First color, MAC, Girl About Town. Gorgeous, vibrant pink color. It's an excellent shade for the holidays, so if you have it, rock it, girl. So... Let me swatch that for you on my left hand. I don't know why I do accents with you guys. There it is. Bam. Vibrant and pink. Very pretty. Love it. Look at that. And against my skin tone. Oh, dark skin sisters. You got this. You got this. You already know my light, medium, fair girls. Y'all know y'all can rock this, but... My dark skin sisters, get it together. Get this on your lips for the holiday season. Next color is Outrageously Fun. This is from the recent holiday collection that MAC released, Glamour Days, I think. Um, so there's that. Swatchity swatch. This is um a lighter pink, of course. Not as vibrant, but very pretty nonetheless. Look at that. Gorgioso. I love it. I love that. That would be the bomb with like cork lip pencil with ample pink plush glass. I just rubbed against my lips. Look at that. With ample pink plush glass, you'd be rocking it. So, um, definitely, if you haven't gotten this lipstick, it's probably not there anymore. I'm sorry. But if you have it, rock it. Um, there are definitely dupes for this color, so I don't want you to feel like you can't get the look if you don't have the limited edition shade. Just brush that off your shoulder, baby. Go ahead and find a dupe. No biggie. Next color... Two. I have two more pinks. This one is Hooked on Pink by Maybelline. 
There's the pretty packaging. Then here is the color. Okay. I do these different varieties of color because I don't want women and girls to be afraid of having a little color on their lips for the holidays. If there's one time, if there has to be one time you're going to rock some lip color, let it be the holidays, girl. Let it be the holidays so you can go ahead and just, you know, be all out. I mean, nobody's going to care. They're sitting around wearing reindeer antlers and elf shoes and cheesy Christmas sweaters, which is the theme of my Christmas party, by the way. Back to the subject at hand. Hooked on pink. Wear your colors for the holidays, girls. We'll go ahead and swatch. There it is, right there. Looking fabuloso. So, get on that. That's drugstore, maybe lean, probably like eight, seven, eight bucks. Next one is a limited edition. It's from L'Oreal from their Project, Project Runway collection and it's called The Queen's Kiss. And it is, it's, this is gorgeous. I don't even know how to describe this color. Look, okay, this is what it looks like in the tube. But watch what happens when I swatch it. And I'm going to swatch it on this hand because this deserves its own space. I want you guys to see how gorgeous this color looks on the lips. So I'm not going to put it on the lips, but you get it against skin. Look the lighting isn't even doing it justice but you see that sheen there the way the light reflects off of that can you imagine how what it would look like if the light hits your lips like that is an attention grabber for sure but it's absolutely gorgeous the camera is not doing it justice it really isn't but there are some there's a some fragments of shimmer in this uh lipstick and it's gorgeous so if you can get your hands on the queen's kiss get your hands on it. Let me show you its sister which is a purple and it's called the Mystics Kiss. Same idea but it's a purple plummy color but same shimmer fragments in it. This is what it looks like. You best believe I will be rocking this. You swatch this like the way that it looks in the tube is not the way it comes out on the lips. It's such a shimmer. Oh, it's gorgeous. Look at that. Look at that. Like, look at that. It's so pretty. I'm trying to, there we go. That's the way you can see it. It doesn't, it's not as intimidating as it looks in the tube. So it goes on a little more sheer, but it's very pretty. Moving on to more purples. Oh, here's another pink. Well, this is a fuchsia. Maybelline Fuchsia Freesia. Here's the pretty case. It's purple. But here's the color. And swatchity swatch. This is for the more conservative lipstick wearers. Don't be intimidated. There that is right there. Very pretty. Rock it. You can do it. Get that confidence. Let's move on to my browns and my plums, shall we? All right. First one, Rimmel Moisture Renew in Burgundy Shine, number 840. Here is the pretty little packaging. Very pretty, a nice burgundy color. Here's a swatch for you. And it's more sheer than it looks, so yay for that there it is very pretty like I said I'm considering the my you know those people that are more conservative and their lipstick wear so look at what I'm rocking and then look at this this is a lot tamer a lot tamer okay next color let's do plum shine by Maybelline number 830 Here's the packaging. It's very cute. And there's the lipstick color. Swatchity swatch, swatch, swatchity swatch. And this one is quite conservative as well. Boom shakalaka. Not there. Very pretty. See them right next to each other. 
Love it. Dazzling Plum, number 835, Maybelline. Here's what it looks like. This one's a bit deeper. This goes back to being a little more daring. Bam, there it is. There it is, very, very pretty. A nice deep plum. And according to the packaging, it's dazzling. Okay, next one. In Style Sienna. I feel like this, will, this was from the Maybe, uh, Maybelline's limited edition like Paris collection or something. I don't know what it was called. But here's the cooler right here. Reddish brown. A little more conservative like I mentioned. There we go. That right there. You can see I'm getting more and more conservative with each color. But don't worry honey. I'm bringing it back. Give me time. Let me work my magic. Next color, Maybelline 305 Copper Charm. Very gorgeous copper color. It reflects, reflects, refracts, reflects light quite beautifully. And there it is. You can barely see it. So, gorgeous though. Absolutely gorgeous. I love how I had reds on this hand and then pinks initially up here and now browns and plums all together. They look like they belong to one family, don't they? I do this strategically. Both of these. Revlon. Revlon Lip Gloss. Color Burst Lip Gloss in Bordeaux. For those of you who are not fans of lipstick, I did think of you. So, you're welcome. Okay. Here's the color. Here's the swatch. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Get on it. Right now. Right this second. Right this second. Get on this. Love it. Make it happen. And like I said, it is called Revlon Color Burst Bordeaux. Next one. Revlon Color Stay Ultimate Liquid Lipstick in Brilliant Bordeaux. See? I make this easy on purpose. You can get Bordeaux, the Color Burst Lip Gloss, or you can get Brilliant Bordeaux and the Ultimate Color Stay Lipstick. Liquid Lipstick. You're welcome. There's the color. It does look brilliant, doesn't it? Swatch it a swatch, swatch it a swatch. Boom. There it is, right there. They're pretty much the same color. One's just a lipstick, the other one's a lip gloss. If you want to, buy them both and just look doubly fabulous. See, they're twinsies, not really. But you get what I'm trying to say. The last two colors, these are my babies. These are the colors that I use to make a statement. If I wanna be seen and known, I will be wearing one of these two shades. Here we go. First, I'm gonna start with last year's favorite. Well, it's not, you yeah, know, last year's favorite. It is a satin lipstick from MAC, and it is called, any guesses? I'll wait. No? All right, all right, I'll tell you. Rebel. Rebel. Tell me that's not a party color. That screams party color. No, it is not too dark. It is not too dark of a color to wear to a holiday party. Rock this color, girl. Be a rebel. No pun intended. Yes, it was. Boom. Look at that. And my hand isn't even doing it justice. Look at that. That is gorgeous. That is a gorgeous, gorgeous color. And I will rock it, honey, like you don't even know. The next one is Amplified, is an Amplified Cream from the latest matte collection in Glamour Days. I think you guys know what I'm gonna say. It was the most intense color of 
the four, five, six lipsticks that came out. Dramatic Encounter. Booyah! Look at that. If you want to have a happy, merry, vampy Christmas, rock this to a party. Rock that to a party. Done. You guys, I can't have a holiday lipstick video without this one. Upside down, upside down. Heroin. Yes, buddy. Yes, yes, yes. Look at that. Allow me to grace you with its presence. And it's a mat. And it's a mat. Boom. Gorgeous. I don't even know if it's limited edition, but if you can get it, get it. If not, sorry. I didn't mean to make you feel guilty about not having it. But for those of you that do have it and have no idea what the heck to do with it, it's the holiday season, go be you. So those are all of my lipsticks. I gave you quite a selection. So I hope that was helpful for you guys, other than watching me be very, very, very silly and expressive, I guess. Um, I, I, I had a fantastic day. Thanks for watching, guys. Leave a comment down below of any suggestions you have for me for holiday lipsticks. Um, what do you think of the suggestions I made for you? I made quite a few on purpose. I gave you some reds, I gave you some browns, some plums, some deep purples. I tried to, some pinks, I tried to give you all across the board. So hope this helps and I will see you guys in my next holiday video, which may be a tag video. We'll see, bye! Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, bye!